Hello Tim, got your booster ready to go. Going to show you how it tests out. Got the vacuum side. Both gauges are tied together and will read vacuum as produced by my pump. And then as the booster is applied, this gauge will go to zero. When it reaches zero, the booster is fully activated and applied. Hydraulic side, obviously we've got the input. Both gauges are tied together. This gauge maxes out and this one reads final input pressure as supplied by the master cylinder on the test machine. Output, both gauges tied together and uh, this will show our, our final uh, pressure uh, when the booster is activated which uh, this is a two to one boost ratio so we're going to have double what we see on this uh, scale right there so we're reading 700 uh, or more on that side uh, just to show you that the uh, booster without vacuum to it is inert which may, that means the fluid going in is the same as the fluid coming out it doesn't do anything it just simply passes the fluid through it and I'll show you that now Input 350, output 350, output 350. Now we're going to hit with vacuum. While we're under pressure, we check for leaks. The place where it can leak is right here at this jammed jam nut or out of the uh, bleed screws. And we're doing fine. The leak down there is my fitting right here. Got a good, got a good booster. Got your air filter rebuilt here. CAD plating, a new vacuum diaphragm and uh, you're good to go. Thank you.